bold and the beautiful fans. Hopefully you're having a magnificent Monday. Yes, we are back from a long vacay after March Madness weekend. And you know what? We got madness in LA to talk about. I'm going to give you a few highlights and then we'll unpack this episode. First, we see Thomas feeling blindsided. Ridge confronts Hope. And Steffi had to console Thomas. So without any other further ado, let's go ahead and unpack this bold and the beautiful episode for March 25th. So in our latest episode of the bold and the beautiful, emotions are running high as Hope, Thomas, and Steffi find themselves entangled in a web of love, betrayal, and family dynamics. The day kicked off with Steffi confronting Hope about her relationship with Thomas. Accusations are flying as Steffi compared Hope to her mother, Brooke, insinuating that Hope is just using Thomas for physical satisfaction while refusing to commit. Now, Steffi fiery warning to stay away from Thomas definitely set a stage for a dramatic showdown and of course we see Hope rebutted all of that but yeah she told her stay away from my brother Meanwhile, in the design office, Thomas is pouring out his heart to his father, Ridge, blindsided, according to him, and devastated by Hope's reluctance to fully commit to the relationship. Now, Ridge, trying to be the supportive father, urges Thomas not to spiral into despair. However, he did reassure his dad, I'm not going to spiral. I'm just disappointed. However, he did assure him that their family will stand by him through thick and thick. Then, as tensions are escalating, Hope found solace in a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with her mother, Brooke. Now, feeling misunderstood and frustrated by Steffi's interference, Hope vowed to handle her relationship's issues with Thomas on her own terms, despite his evident distress. Ridge came in and had a whole confrontation with Hope saying how she broke his son's heart. And of course, she was like, look, I know that I didn't want to get married now. I just don't want the commitment, but I still want to see him. And then Brooke is, of course, siding with her daughter. However, that put a little bit of tension between Ridge and Brooke because they started going back and forth with each other. Yeah, this whole thing could actually spill over into other relationships which I guess we'll have to see. But at this point, she is trying to put this relationship back together on her own terms, even though Thomas won a commitment. Back over at Thomas's place, Thomas is wrestling with conflicting emotions as he reminisced about his time with Hope. Steffi arrives, brought a glimmer of comfort as she reminded him of his worth and urged him to consider ending things with Hope for his own well-being. In a tender moment between these two siblings, Steffi reassured Thomas of her unwavering support and encouraged him to prioritize his own happiness over his tumultuous relationship relationship with Hope. As the episode reached its climax, Thomas faced a crucial decision to continue holding on to Hope for a future with Hope or to heed Steffi's advice and move on. She said that he could have any woman that he wanted, and that's probably the truth. And with these emotions running high and the stakes higher than ever, we were left on our edge of our seats, eagerly anticipating the next twist in this gripping saga of love and heartbreak. Okay, so there you have it. Let's get the conversation started down in the comment section. What do you think about that confrontation between Ridge and Hope? Hope is not backing down. She want to do things on her own terms. However, when it comes to Ridge, he is not happy that his boy is devastated. And of course, he supports Steffi as he says that she's trying to look out for her brother. What about the confrontation between Hope and Steffi? Steffi told her to stay away from her brother. She said, you know what? what, Steffi, mind your own business. The question is, who's going to win that battle? And then Steffi having a heart-to-heart -heart with Thomas, she gave him a lot to think about. I guess the decision is that he's going to make whether or not he's going to pursue this relationship as is or move on. Also, make sure you check out the Young and the Restless recap for today. Jordan is alive. We saw Phyllis pulling a fire alarm to ruin romance, and Heather and Daniel was under fire. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on your notifications so you're notified every time a video is posted. And until the next one, we'll see you all soon. Bye, guys.